In this video, we will learn about a new component from React Native Elements and it's called Speed Dial. Basically, it's a fab button, floating action button that we have seen in our last video. But it's ex expandable. We can provide multiple fab button inside of Speed Dial. Let me just show you. As you can see, this is the Speed Dial. When you click it, it expands and you can provide multiple fab icons. And we we'll click on the close button, it will collapse again. So let us just create this component. Open uh, a React Native project on Visual Studio Code and open a iOS simulator or Android simulator. I already opened the iOS simulator. Now, first of all, we need to import speed dial from React Native Elements. Not this. React Native Elements. Now, first of all, we need to create a state to keep track of the uh, open or close uh, uh, functionality of the speed dial. Let's open state open. By default, it will be collapse. It it collapse. It then by default it will be false. Let us create speed dial. Okay. So first of all, let us provide the props for the speed dial. The first one is is open. It will depend on the open set that we have just created. Now we can provide the icon. We can also provide the title. But for this example, we will be providing the icon. We can directly name our icon. Let's say edit. We can provide the color for the icon. Let's say white. Now, when we uh, open the speed dial button, then and uh, it expands then we at that moment we can change the icon for the speed dial so we say open icon name will be close color will be white now on open we can provide the on open we can provide the functions set open and we set it to the opposite of the current state similarly on close we provide the same Let me just save this. As you can see, this is our title. We have provided icon instead of title over here. Now let us create the buttons. We'll create two button speed dial dot action. Here we can provide the props for the button. Let us provide the icon. Name. Let's say add. Color. Will be same white. We can provide the title. head right now we we do not pro we have not provide we have not created any functions so 
we will provide the on price event later on let me just copy this much paste it over here for the second we can make it delete title will be delete as you can see it works perfectly fine when i click on the button it says add delete this is our icon that we have provided over here add and delete and this title displayed on the left hand side and the icon is changed when i open it to it change to close icon and when i press again it will change back to the edit if uh, uh, you want to provide uh, coloring to this then you can use button style let's say background color will be yellow as you can see now let us provide this add a uh, button uh, uh, background color of green If I press on this, as you can see, it's green. And let us provide this one. Red. Okay. So as you can see, add or delete. Instead of naming add, let's name it submit. okay uh, sorry for that we need to type submit here the title okay as you can see submit and delete now let us create a state for the name by default it will be an empty string let us also import the input let us create an input placeholder will be name value will be name and on change text we simply set the whatever text is input to set name Let me just save this. Now let us create a function that we can call from this both. Const, let's say submit. Let us create an alert dot alert. Welcome. hello and name welcome to our app let me just save this now on this first speed dial action the submit button we can call on press we can simply call this submit and on this on press we set it to we set name to again the empty string let me just save this so if I write my name over here um, submit you can see hello bridge and welcome to our app as you can see it works perfectly fine and now let me just delete it so it will delete it so uh, after pressing these buttons if we want these to collapse again then we can also do that over right these we set open to 
open we will save this and let's write bruce as you can see uh, the uh, alert is appear and this also collapse itself let me provide this over here also You save this if I press on this and delete the text will be cleared and this will automatically collapse so basically this is how we can create a speed dial this is a very much important functionality if uh, you have if you do not use react native elements then you have to create this component by your own a custom component you need to use the animation to provide this type of animations also so it is better to use the react native elements so that's it for this video thanks for watching it